Hello, fellow horn players. Now I know starting band or starting the French horn can seem a little intimidating. So in today's video, I asked some of my students to give you some tips or some things that they wish they knew before they started playing the horn. Okay, so the French horn is a brass instrument. So whoever's telling you to try to sound like a saxophone or a clarinet needs to get out because you're supposed to be loud and aggressive. Our bell is backwards. So make sure you play with a lot of air so you can be loud, louder than tubas. When you're starting the French horn, it's not good to pinch force your mouth onto the mouthpiece to get out high notes. It's better just to either blow faster air or tighten your embouchure. So when you start playing, please don't put your hand like so high into the bell. Like put it like a like a reasonable place, like over here maybe. Cause like it blocks your sound and it makes you sound like really like it doesn't sound good. So yeah. It also makes like your it also it can also make your sound like sound like sharp and flat and stuff. That's not good. So. I wish somebody told me that you use your left hand to push the valves instead of your right hand. Sometimes you don't know where your spit is. I wish somebody would have told me the right place to put my hand. I wish I knew before I started French horn that when you got braces, it would like kind of like make you take a step back and like you have to like relearn some things. One thing I wish I knew about playing French horn before I played it is that the embouchure is completely different and you don't need to like listen to your friends and band to tell you you're doing it wrong. We have a totally different part than the rest of the band, so it's gonna be harder to actually learn since you have to adapt to your own sound. <laughs> that French horn would be so difficult. One thing I wish I knew before being a French horn is that it's one of the hardest instruments to play and that if you like make the slightest move while playing it's the, it will play a completely different note so it's very hard trying to get a solid note out sometimes. I wish somebody told me that we had to blow a lot of air when playing French horn. Um, I wish that you I knew that you had to put your hand in the horn for it to sound better. Um, something I wish I knew before I started playing horn is that like it would start off like really low and then go really high. So one thing someone would have told me before band is um, of how much the instruments cost because mine was like nine hundred dollars. So you bought it? Okay. Something I didn't know at first, like well, I thought they were like I didn't know what. So like on the flute figure chart, you had like like to like figure out right but I was playing the wrong notes the whole time because I realized that it was like these three I thought it was like different ones uh. so I was playing different notes I wish someone had taught me how to read the finger chart I wish someone told me that playing the flute and talking gets really like hard because if you talk a lot and you play the flute a lot and you're doing it both you're gonna run out of breath Oh, what do you wish someone would have told you about band before you started? I wish somebody would have told me that you would have to have a lot of air control. I wish somebody would have told me we had to play by ourselves in front of the whole group. I wish someone told me that this would not be easy. I wish somebody told me that this French horn requires so much air that I do not have in these lungs. Like, uh -oh. <laughs> I love my students. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe so you don't miss a video. And until next time, go practice.